So these are the Mimi gloves. Um, they're wearable wireless gestural controllers and musical instruments, and we use them to make music. Um, they work by sensors that are embedded in the fabrics. Um, they measure the bend, bend of your fingers, and, um, and another movement sensor that measures where you are in space. So our software can recognize different um, postures, for example, that you make with your hand. So for example, now if I make a fist, I can trigger different sounds in different, um, um, different directions. So up is that chord, forward is that chord. And what you can hear is that with the roll of my, my left wrist, I control the filter on the sound so I can bring it in. And then if I want make one finger point with my right hand, the sound stops. And then on my one finger point on my left hand, I've got some bells. A thin flame runs under my skin. There's only noise. Can't see a thing. The software allows us to capture the information sent by sensors in the glove and to recognize postures, maybe a fist or an open hand or a one finger point. And then it allows a musician to connect any gesture, so a raising of the hand or making a fist or sharp movements to any sound in any piece of music software. So you can compose electronic music using gesture, which is visual and uh, explains to an audience what's happening rather than looking down at your computer and just with the mouse or the keyboard. The Gloves Project, what it was originally called, um, started about five years ago with um, an uh, English artist called Imogen Heap and she travelled the world with her studio basically to, um, to be able to perform her music in a way that felt true to her very elaborate creations. Um, she wanted to make something completely new that could do all of those things and make it more expressive as well for the audience to understand all of the electronic bits that she was doing. Yeah.